Hello everyone, it's Pastor Derek and Sel Julia coming to you once again from the marriage school and I want to believe that you have had a very fruitful week. As usual, we have Pastor Derek here with us, so we want to say a big welcome to Pastor Derek. You welcome Pastor Derek and it's good to have you once again. Thank How have you. you been? I've been good by God's grace, all is well. We bless God. And how are you too? I'm doing very well by God's grace. I like your shoes. You really look nice. And I like your dress. <laughs> you look nice too. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we want to continue with our session on the ways by which you know if a man loves you. And a quick recap of what we did last week. He said that if a man loves you, he will introduce you to his family. He will respect your opinion. He will feel for you. He will spend on you generously. So today we want to go a lot deeper and see what we can learn again. So Pastor Derek, what can you um, tell us? What do you have for us today? How will we know if a man is madly in love with us? Right. Hello, everybody. I uh, want to believe that you are all doing great. When a man loves you, he apologizes when he misses it. You see, when a man loves you, he knows that you matter and your feelings and your, 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 your thoughts matter to him. And so when he hurts you, when he offends you, when he gets it wrong, he does not defend himself. Neither does he allow his ego to lead him. He knows that the love he has for you is higher and more important than his, his ego. So it doesn't matter how big he is. He's able to swallow his pride and come down to you and say, listen, I'm sorry. What I told you, I'm sorry for speaking to you the way I did. I'm sorry I didn't come at the time I said I would. I'm sorry I didn't measure up as expected of me. He He's not afraid to humble himself to apologize because he values the relationship more than his pride and his ego. You know, as you were saying, as you said mm. that um, swallow his pride. Yeah. I most of the time we know that if a man swallows his pride and he apologizes, he's not considered to be a man enough. They they say that if you're a man, you need to be tough. You just walk over, but that is not the right thing to Mommy, do. Mommy, genuine love melts every hardness Ooh, within a man you see love, men say it again, say it again. are i said genuine love melts, melts every hardness in a man i like that uh, 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 men are tough until they meet the woman they really love if mm -hmm. he really loves you he cannot be tough anymore he will be soft you would every man has a soft side mm. and it's only revealed when real love is at work wow. when a man loves you you will see his soft side so no matter how tough he is when there's love you definitely see his soft side what else can we learn from you today Pastor? right when a man loves you really loves you and wants to spend all his life with you this is whether it's before marriage or during marriage he respects you because when he loves you he now begins to value you as an equal part of his life yeah. so the same respect that he gives to himself, himself he gives you and even sometimes more, more yeah he respects you so he doesn't denigrate you he doesn't talk down uh, on you he doesn't look down on you he doesn't throw away your your thoughts and your mm -hmm. opinions he respects you when you speak to him he hears yes, it please. as if his mother is talking to him yeah. because he sees you as a long term uh, 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 partner he respects you he doesn't he doesn't trash you he doesn't walk uh, 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 over you. So that is one key thing to look out for. A man who respects you. A man who doesn't get angry because you missed an appointment or you were late for an appointment. He doesn't start slamming doors when you miss it. He doesn't shout and, uh, at you and, and doesn't scream at you and, and doesn't uh, uh, disgrace you in public or make you feel like you are worth nothing. Only criticizing you, talking bad things about you all the time. No, no, no. no. When a man really loves you, he, he, he sees you as some, some glorious person and he shows you so much respect in the way he talks to you, the way he reacts to your, 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 your shortcomings and everything. He shows you respect. He values your opinion. He values your thoughts. Yeah. He values who you are. Yeah. I mean, um, I was just going to add that, that it mm. means that he asks your opinion on issues. Yeah. He, doesn't, he doesn't just take um, decisions without asking you, your inputs, what you think and all that. And and when you give an opinion, 
he doesn't rubbish it mm -hmm. he takes your opinion yeah. on board yeah that is that is so true mm -hmm. so if he is apologizing to you when he misses it and if he respects you then you will know that you are in the right hands any more pastor Derek, please yeah when a man really loves you he sees beauty in you you see, there's a saying that beauty is in the eye of, of the, the beholder. beholder. Yeah. Right? When a man loves you, everybody would say you are ugly. <laughs> he sees you as the as most beautiful, beautiful woman on earth. And sometimes people will be wondering, like, what does this man see, see in yeah. this woman? What does this man find in this woman? This ugly woman, why is he... <laughs> oh, no, no, he doesn't see ugliness. As far as he's concerned, you are the most beautiful. You are the most beautiful. He sees your face as an angel. Is he's, that why we say love is blind? Yeah, love is blind. Mm -hmm. Because love, love only sees beauty. Because you know what? True beauty is not a matter of what the eye see. True beauty is what the heart sees. Mm. So when the heart connects to somebody, when you love somebody, you don't see blemishes. And that is that is how, as Christians, that Jesus is how sees Jesus us. sees us. Yeah. With all our sins, with all our mess. When God looks at us, God doesn't look at us through our sins. He looks at us through the love of Christ. And he only sees a holy church, a pure people, wonderful people. That's exactly how it is. When a man loves you, he sees beauty in you. He can look at you and look at you. And that's what something that you are amazed because your whole family, as you're growing up, your father doesn't think you are beautiful. Your mother doesn't think you are beautiful. <laughs> your brothers and sisters all think you are so ordinary. But then you but meet you this, this man, man who keeps and he's telling all you, over you. You are so beautiful. You are so, you beautiful. Are so beautiful. And sometimes you wonder, you ask yourself, is I'm it really? real? <laughs> yes, it is real. It is love. Love makes us see beauty. So if that man is, is with you and he's never said you are beautiful, you are beautiful he never or sees... he keeps saying you are ugly, you are ugly. Yeah. He means that he really doesn't he, love he you. He doesn't love you. Because if he loves you, he will see beauty. Every human being has something beautiful about them. Yeah. It may not be on your face. Yeah. It may be in your legs. Yeah. It may be in your hair. It may be in your hands. It may be in the way you talk. Look, your face may not look nice, but that man will fall in love with your voice and, and or how you talk or how you walk. And he'll always be saying it. He goes, ah, I like the way you walk. I like the way you, oh, I like your legs. I like your legs. Oh, I like your, your wherever or your whatever. A man will see beauty in the woman he loves. If he's not seeing any beauty, he hasn't found love in you. Thank you so much, Pastor Derek. I think we will have time for one or two more. Right. When a man loves you, he sees something great in you. He sees greatness. Okay. A man who genuinely loves you will at least locate one thing that is great about you. He will know that, let's say, either you are a great cook or you are a great singer, or you are a great accountant, or you are a great entrepreneur, or you are a great mathematician, or you are you are a great mother, or you are... You see, he will see something in you that he thinks that nobody else has that quality. And it's, it's very, very important because every human being wants to be valued, not just accepted, but to be... You see, you see when you are in a marriage or in a relationship, you don't just want to be there because, okay, he accepts me there. You want to be there knowing that you are so important. There is something so special like you in you. Needed. Yeah, like you were sought after. You were, you, 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 you were head, is it? Handpicked or head, head. There's something, when they are doing recruitment, they, they, they say there's a head something, like they, 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 they pick you up, like that, yeah. Forgive me about that, but yeah, it's like hand picked or head, head something. Okay, the word is, is missing in my head. All right, okay, so like you were picked, you were chosen because of chosen. something special. He he's, he he finds something special in you, and he always talks about that, and he always identifies it, and and that special thing draws him to you, and so you are special. You are very, very, yeah, head-hunted, mm. head-hunted. Yeah, so you are head-hunted. You know what, what it means to head-hunt? Head-hunt is to, uh, 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 it's like we are running an organization, mm -hmm. but we need somebody with a special skill. skill. And then we look around and say, oh, in that company, Okay. There is somebody who has that skill and we look for an opportunity to go and pick that person and we tell them that we need you here, we will pay you even twice what they are paying you there. Yeah. It's like they will go to pick you, resign. We will, we will. That is how it is because you are so special. Yeah. When a man really loves you, he will 
He will headhunt you. He will let you know that he didn't just pick you because you are a woman. Yeah. He picked you because there is something so special about, about you. That. you. That's why we say that I can never live without you. <laughs> you, you see, some men say that I can never live without you. But it's like because there is something in you that if I don't get it, I can leave. Uh, and another person wrote us and said, if you leave me, I I'll will die. die. I will die. <laughs> right, because they, you are so special. Some say you are the air that I breathe. You are. Like, you are where are you getting all these raps from? <laughs> I, I, it's a long story. It's a long story. But yes, he, he appreciates something very, very great about you. And, 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 and it's great to know that you are in a relationship where your husband feels that you are a great person and you are not just an ordinary person. So, so look out for that. Look out for that. Look out for that. Thank you so much, Pastor yeah. Derek. One more, one more. Um, to know if a man loves us. When a man loves you, he misses you. Ooh. Mm -mm. When you are not there, he will miss you and he will call you. And it doesn't matter how long you've been married for. Real love always misses the other part. When a man loves you, he will miss you. You could have just left the home 15 minutes ago. He will start missing you. He will start calling. How are you? Is everything okay? Where are you? Let me tell you, ladies. Sometimes when your man is calling you over and over and over, don't get offended. Don't let anybody put this thing in your head that he's being it's too... Like he's monitoring Yeah, he's monitoring you. you. It is love. The man who doesn't love you, it's absent from the... Uh, absent, <laughs> absent, uh, it's like out of sight, out, out of, of mind. mind. If he doesn't love you, once you go out, you are gone. That's it. And he doesn't remember you again till you come back. And when you come, to, oh, it's you, you are back. He wasn't expecting you. <laughs> but the man who genuinely loves you, he will call you. Where are you? So what are you doing? So where have you reached? So have you eaten? So who is with you? Who are you talking to? So how's the weather there? They will keep asking you unnecessary questions. I'm begging you on behalf of all men. Don't get offended. It is real love. <laughs> Someone, I've seen, I'm a counselor, we hear this, oh, he's all, all over all me, over he you, doesn't yeah. allow me to have space, no, it is, he doesn't allow, no, me, to is, doesn't allow me to be, yeah, space. I need my, it is love, <laughs> when a man loves you, he will miss you, he will miss you, when you are not there, he will call you, he will text you, he will message you, and even when you are there, he will value your presence, mm -hmm. he will want to do things with you. If you want to watch a movie, you want to choose a movie that you will like so that your presence can be with him. Okay, he want to do things with you. If he's eating, he can't eat until you come. Me, eh, when I'm left at home alone, the whole day, even if I'm not fasting, I can't eat until my wife is here with me. You know, because I don't know the food. I know the food is there. I know the quantity I can take. But I lose appetite just because my wife is not with me. I may, I may say I lose appetite. I can't eat until she comes because it is love. It's missing. So when a man loves you, he will miss you. He will call you. He will look for you. He will do things that will make you know that he has missed you. When you come home, you come and see that he's just still wearing his boxer shirt, sitting down quietly. Wait he hasn't you. done anything the whole day. <laughs> it means he was missing you. You, you went so he away. Was useless yeah. The whole day. yeah, he was useless the whole day. You went away with his energy. You went away with his breath. He was nothing until you oh, came back. Yeah. We do that a lot. Sometimes my wife is like, I can't do anything mm -hmm. because she's not around. It is love. It is genuine love. So when a man loves you, he will he miss you. you. If your man never misses you, he doesn't, he love, doesn't you. love you. He doesn't love you. <laughs> but I hope you have a man who misses who you. Misses and who loves you. Who misses you. Yeah. you. Oh, thank you so much once again, Pastor Derry. You're so welcome. if he apologizes when he misses it, if he respects your opinions or he respects you, if he sees beauty in you, if he sees greatness in you, and if he misses you, know that you are loved. God bless you. And until we come your way again, it's Pastors Derek and Celgilia from the Murray School. Have a good week. God bless Bye. you. Bye-bye.